Day 48. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Anybody else feel like April was just like so long but so short too? Like, whole month, April, all of April. Only got to go outside to grocery shop. And, and throw out my garbage and recycling. So that could be like May. That very real, real, realistically could be like May too. My birthday's in June. I don't know. Hey, so in this time, a lot of, I've kind of found a lot of theme parks seem to be releasing different recipes for food that you could normally eat at their park. So I've got like a whole list of different ones that I want to try. Some may not happen. Um, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, but definitely this one caught my interest. Um, I've never had it. It's apparently from the Disney parks. I've never personally had it before. <laughs> Um, but it's a, kind of a twist on a classic and that's kind of my thing. I like, I like mixing it up a little bit with, um, classic recipes and kind of thinking a little bit more outside the box. So this is a grilled cheese. So I don't quite have all the necessary ingredients. I, the main, the main thing I didn't have was cheddar. <laughs> cheese does not last long with me. <laughs> um, so I, I ended up running out of cheddar. So instead I'm just gonna use mozzarella. Um, it'll give it a slightly different flavor, but it'll actually, it'll actually melt better. So this could work out in my favor. So I've already set up um, the garlic spread and the cream cheese spread as well. I've already made those. So it's not fully processed because I don't have a food processor, so I literally just stirred it up, but that's fine. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not too worried about that. And then the garlic spread. So I've got my mozzarella and my provolone cheese and my bread. So looks like you have to do, so the recipe is made for eight sandwiches, it looks like. I don't need eight sandwiches, obviously. So I kind of took it down, obviously, quite, quite a few. <laughs> so just put out your um, bread. And then you're just putting, it looks like your cheddar or mozzarella, in my case, on the bread first. And then put the provolone on top of the cheddar flash mozzarella and then you put after that you put your cream cheese spread on top of oh <clears throat> my bad <laughs> so apparently you don't the provolone so the provolone goes on a separate one so you've got your one bread with the cheddar or mozzarella in my case and the other slice with the provolone. So the slice that has the provolone is the one that you put the cream cheese spread on top of. So just spread that on top of the provolone cheese. There you go. So you just like that. So then you put the two slices together. Like that. Okay, so you want to have a skillet heating or pan heating over medium high heat, I believe. Over medium heat. The next step says to brush both sides of the sandwich with the garlic spread. I don't have a brush. Shockingly. <laughs> I thought I did, but apparently I do not. <laughs> Uh, so that's another item that I need to get as soon as I'm able to because <laughs> uh, it's kind of crazy that I don't have a pastry brush. But, so, 
super easy, but it's not super necessary here, fortunately. You can just spread it on. Just like that. Side note, any extra cream cheese spread you have? Really good on crackers. Mm, really good on crackers. Okay, so my pan should be heated up. We're just gonna bring it over and put it in the pan, just like this. So here you can see the grilled cheese in the pan. So it says about two minutes per side until the cheese is melted and the crust is, or the bread is nice and golden. Again, you can tell the one side is done when it looks like that. See that nice golden color? You can also hear and see the cheese start to melt. Yum! And there, you, and there you go. Nice gooey. Oh, yummy. I think I put a lot of cream cheese spread <laughs> in the middle, but I'm okay with that. Nice ooey gooey grilled cheese sandwich. Oh yeah. That takes it up another notch for sure. Yeah, I don't think a regular grilled cheese will ever suffice again. Mm. I need to m maybe make some fancy ketchup to uh, to go with that because I don't think regular ketchup is good enough. <laughs> maybe that that's for another day. <laughs> Enjoy. Seriously, I know it's petty. But good gosh. And over the traffic noise too. I can almost tell what they're watching or what they're listening to. Anyway, it hasn't been a super productive day. I mean, as you saw, it's just, I just made the, the grilled cheese today. I spoke with my grandmother for a long time. But she needs, she's lonely. She needs somebody to talk to. So she talked to me. And it sounds like luckily she, she's, she's doing okay. You know, she's she's in a nursing home, so that scares me a little bit, but um, she's, she's doing okay. I'm super excited. It's almost time for an all rise, and it's a completely virtual episode. Like, they've, they've filmed it while we're in lockdown, and so, like, it's all each cast member did their own makeup, did their own everything, unless they had a partner, of course. <laughs> and then I'm sure they had their partner's help. But, and like their own filming, like everything. So this should be really cool. I'm super, super excited to see this. So cool. The only thing that comes close was, as far as I know, the episode um, of Modern Family where it was all over Claire's computer. Pretty much you saw what Claire saw, saw Claire's screen. Um, but I'm sure that that was just like editing and I'm sure that they, you know, didn't have to, <laughs> you know, however they edit it together. <laughs> I know a little bit about that now, <laughs> but this, this was like literally done obviously because they're not, they couldn't go in, <laughs> um, all done at each of their homes. So that is so, so cool. I'm super, super excited to see it. Super excited to see it. It should be really, really cool. 
so cool. I never thought, I honestly never thought I would love All Rise this much because I'm more of the cop drama than the like law and order and the courtroom dramas have never appealed to me. Um, I don't know why, <laughs> but I really, really like All Rise. It's really, really good. Really poignant too about um, like things, situations that we're living through and which I mean having this episode just makes complete sense <laughs> like of course of course um because yeah so but it's so cool that they were able to pull it off and just the sneak peeks that I've seen um yeah it's, I'm super super excited super excited oh starting soon okay bye so loud so, so loud. And of course, today was the day that I chose to not drink. You know, I can't drink every day. Just because I'm in quarantine, I can't drink every day. <laughs> Gotta take some time off. My liver will appreciate it. <laughs> so today I chose that day. Today was not a good day to choose. Of all the days to choose, today was not a good day. <laughs> but... What the heck is that noise? And I say that after reviewing my recordings and seeing that during my, when I was making the grilled cheese, you could hear my TV too. But there's no walls. I live in a tiny apartment. Of course you can hear my TV. You can hear my TV anywhere. I could have, and I did have it pretty silent. That's not silent. That's not silent. See? See? Not silent. Anyway. So, yeah, just finished watching All Rise. Really cool. Really, yeah, definitely a unique, a unique thing. You know, just, and I know, <laughs> I feel for the editors, but I know it's their job to put stuff like that together. Different videos from different people doing their own thing at home. But I've had a little taste of it the past few weeks. So, <laughs> and that's, and mine's like so minor. <laughs> so I feel for the editors, but awesome job. Like it was, it was so cool. It's one of those things that, you know, I, I kind of want to buy the season now just to have that one episode, just to be able to show like future generations and my kids and stuff and be like, hey, watch this. So that was pretty much how we had to live our life for months, <laughs> for 48 days and counting. <laughs> um, you know, I think, I think that would be cool. Of course, there's going to be all these, <laughs> these, <laughs> um, but yeah, that's, yeah, I'm, it, it was, it was really, it was really neat, really, really cool. Um, and I'm glad, I'm glad that they did it. That was really, you know, to pull all, all that off. The entire cast and crew, well done, guys. Well done. Thank you for that. <laughs> Thank you. So, 